Hey everyone, since I got a lot of requests today, I'm going to be doing a tutorial on vertical and horizontal teleportation. So first things first, if you put, uh, you don't want to put the barrier right where the player is standing. The barrier has to be put one below the player. That's important. The barrier has to be one below, otherwise the player will be killed. Uh, second thing, you can only teleport the player one block at a time. So if I make it this big, the player is going to be teleporting two blocks. That doesn't work. You have to do one block at a time. Like that. And then third thing, you have to make uh, the other axes greater than the axes you're teleporting on. Otherwise, the player might teleport in a different direction than you're trying to teleport them in. So this way, it'll teleport them up and not in another direction. And then you want to place on a sequencer and set it to the same uh, channel as the barrier. Now for horizontal teleportation, you have to place the barrier sideways on a wall, like that. Once again, it has to be below, one below the player, and uh, you can only teleport one block at a time. Just like that, you need to make the other axes greater than the axes you're teleporting the player on, otherwise they could get teleported, you know, this way instead. Once again, you gotta place on another trigger. So yeah, horizontal, place it underneath and flat. I mean, vertical, underneath and flat. Horizontal, underneath, and place the barrier on a wall. Let's just start the game to show you how this works. Oh, whoops, I made another mistake here. So this is something else that's important to do. Basically, I forgot to disable the barriers, so they're on at the start of the game. So I need to go back and make sure they're disabled. See, when it says enabled, gameplay only, you want to change that to disabled. See, when I step on this trigger, I get teleported upwards. And if I step on this trigger, I get teleported to the side. And another important thing to mention is that you have to be moving for this to work. You cannot be teleported when you're not moving. So basically you can't have a player just standing still to be teleported. See, so yeah, that's really it. Uh, if you want to teleport a player and uh, multiple blocks at a time you have to do multiple teleportations so you have to add in more barriers uh if you use this in one of your maps you don't have to credit me but credit would be appreciated and uh please consider using my code pimit thank you